Yo, what's good guys? So it's early in the morning right now. Um, the boo-boo is still sleep. But yeah, so while she's sleeping, um, I'm just gonna record this because we're gonna start our day pretty like early. So um we're gonna head to Target in a little bit and then we're gonna go get breakfast, we're gonna cook, and then we're gonna go thrifting today. Um it's in the plans today to go cut my hair. But we'll see. But yeah, today's gonna be a trip to Thrift Numero. I don't know. Let's go. Bye. I'm with the boo boo right now. If you can guess where we are Target. There's Target. No, we're in Target. <laughs> Getting some breakfast right now. Um, today's the day. You can see my hair's a little messy right now because I don't give up about it anymore. Cutting it off today. Three years. So long. But. I'm gonna head to LA today, um, BTLA Cuts Barbershop. Uh, my boy Brandon is gonna cut me up. Yeah, we'll see what I do to it. It's time. Me and the boo boo about to make breakfast. That protein? Trying to open that Kodiak cakes. Huh. Starting this thing off at a good way. Let's see what they got. Not sure if this one's a bootleg, but it doesn't have a tag, but the stitching's kind of bad right there. Probably gonna leave it, but I did find this vintage um, Mega T, size XL. Statue of Liberty, New York. In the pink colorway, single stitch. It's actually pretty hard. Does it have a year? Right there, 1990. Nothing on the back. Picking this one up though. Look at all the fake Yeezys. There's three pairs in there. The other pairs are here. I feel like Pablo, Shredback, probably a remake. Polo duffel bag. It's actually in pretty good condition. They're asking for six. These don't do too well. I've actually never seen this color before, but it's a vintage pair of um, dead stock Hilfiger Athletic pants. The sides are crazy. It's like a plastic, like, baby blue. Taxing up. They're asking for 10, I think? 11. 10.99. Let's see. Super fake LV side bag. Found this Kendrick Lamar snap bag. Or a strap bag. And then this vintage Lakers starter snap bag. So hard, but look, it's missing the top, like, um, button thing that usually is on top of a hat. I don't know if I'm gonna cop. I might still get it. It's five dollars. This is so hard. Uh, taxing, but at least this one has a tag. I'm for sure copping this stuff. Oh yeah, baby. Yo, to anyone who plays golf, this custom denim jacket is hard. Yo, that's so tough. Twenty. This is why it pays off to do your research. I just looked this up, vintage MC Escher tees, and they go for like 80 to $100 each. Yo, and they're both only five bucks. Oh my God. Vintage North Face Denali, size large, and then your boy came up on the Polo Comforter. Crazy. Yo, this is just one of those days. This just looks like a regular tower, right? When you flip it over. Oh, yeah. Yes, tower? Scoop, baby. Vintage Made in USA Jaguar shot back. For sure gonna pick this one up. This one's so clean. Vintage Nike soccer hat. Surf Cup San Diego. See the tag? It's got the check right there. It's got the Nike tag inside. And I found these right here, size 13. They're asking for 20, but it looks bad. Like, look at the bar. Actually, that's really bad, but probably gonna leave them. I got this fanny pack. Not new. Get a new headquarters camo. Not bad. Three bucks. Maybe. Vintage Los Angeles Raiders too. Starter. Tag that so. I'm gonna pick this one up. Six dollars. Just realized that's like writing right there. I actually don't know if that'll come out. Let's see. On this vintage Nikki. Nikki. 
Oh my god, Nike windbreaker. It's got super like bad stains on it. I don't know if y'all can see it. It's like really bad and it's like all over. I'm gonna have to leave this. So I found two bags in the bag section. Vintage guest duffel. It actually has the vintage guest tag inside. And it says guest on the actual um, the zipper pull. But you can see the tag right here. Oh no. You can see right there. It says guest made in USA. And this one's kind of crazy. I've actually never seen this colorway of this bag. But they're taxing 20 bucks. But like I said, I've never seen this color. So I might have to pick it up. We'll see. Big logo seven. No retards. Chicago Bulls. 1996 four time champion. Four time NBA champions. You see right there. Made in USA size large. $10 though. I'm gonna have to pass on this. This one actually doesn't go for that much. The logo seven. It's like this exact shirt sold on eBay for like less than $10. No way. Just found the Stussy. Eight ball hoodie. It's got the eight balls all around it and then in the back as well. Eight dollars. They're right here for $4.99. A vintage Fruit of the Loom X Files crew neck. Season six. Scooping. All right, so I just want to start off by showing you guys um, what I picked up. This is obviously the polo blanket. Right here, I picked up the guest duffel. Y'all thought I picked up the polo. If you follow me on Instagram. Um, but I did pick up the guest one. And then right here, I found two hats. The Los Angeles Lakers, the Jaguar strap back with the leather. Um, the Chanel, bootleg Chanel crew neck. Crazy. Um, two tees of the MC Eschers. North Face Denali jacket. And a purple envelope or something. Nice. Some blue Air Maxes right here. Pretty bad paint. Some polka dot Cortezes. New age though. These are like 2014. Some Mighty Duck starter pieces. Little crew neck, Mighty Duck top And it's got starter on the back. It's pretty simple. And then this one right here. Another starter. 12.99 size small. It's got a lot of stains on it. There's a big one right here. I might have scooped if it had the big like logo on the back, but it's pretty plain. How are they gonna leave both of them? Oscar De La Hoya Sugar Saint Mosley tea. This actually looks like a wrap tea. I'm not sure if it is, but it definitely has like the same colors and everything as a wrap tea would. We'll do some research, but probably gonna pick it up. They're only asking for a dollar. 99 cents, I'm probably gonna scoop. Vintage Ralph Lauren, like laptop case, got the two pouches, ten dollars. Yo. You see why I wanna cut that man? It's looking way too messy, bro. Just got to the mall real quick. Um, the Boo Boo's gotta return something at Nordstrom. Um, and then we're gonna head out to LA. We are going to stop at Wasteland, not round two, I'm sorry. We're gonna stop at Wasteland to sell some items because that's a store that will take the items I actually want to let go of. Um, but yeah, so here at the mall, then we're gonna head to LA. Okay, we got got the Tommy's on. It's cool. Always inside. Yo, it's good guys. So we just pulled up to LA right now, man. I really cannot wait to take this off. We luckily got a spot super, super close to the um, to the store to Wasteland. But I got the duffel right here, the guest duffel. We got a good amount of items in there, so. Yo, so they took a good amount. Ugh, I look fat from that angle. <laughs> Alright, so they took a good amount. Um, the bags obviously still got a little bit in it. But I sold, I think, like... Maybe seven or... Seven to like nine pieces. And they gave me 177 cash. So not bad. So we gonna eat good, right, boo? What do you mean? Mm. Oh, dude. Alright, let's go grow. Okay. Acai uh, bowl. Dude, this looks extra fire and so big. 10 bucks. Yeah. So I pull up to the spot I'm getting a haircut. Look at all these bumps in a row. You guys are gonna enjoy this with me. Ready? <laughs> I'm not done yet. 
Hold on. Oh my god. Alright, let's find some shade, boy. Alright, guys. Get one last look at this long hair. It's just too long now. It's literally from like here to like here. It's long. So it's time to cut it off. I'm gonna go for like a crop look where it's basically gonna be combed forward. And then I'm gonna have all the texture in here and then lightly lined up right here. And then skin fade. 20 more minutes. Should I back out? Should I back out? It's been three years of growth. But it's just, it's too messy now. There's just so many hairs like sticking hey. out. From Who are you talking to? There's just so many hairs sticking out now because every time I tie it, there's like snaps. Like it just breaks and then now little hairs like just stick out through the long hair. So just the pomade don't work. So it's time to let it go. You see right there, DTLA cuts. It's gonna be so short. No, not super short. Alright, uh, y'all, it's time. My boy Brandon. He's gonna give me the transformation. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Oh my god, yo. My hair is long, bro. Look at that. <laughs> when you had it tied up, I was like, I yeah, I was people like, don't realize. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, uh, <laughs> super nice shop. Can you get a clean uh, cut so I can try to donate it? Or no? I can. Yeah. yeah. I don't even know the length I need, but I'm pretty sure this is long. You about to cut it? Yeah. Ready? Yeah, go ahead, bro. Oh my god, <laughs> There it is, right there. Yeah, I'm gonna save that. Oh my god, dude. That's not even all of it. Man. Yo, it's coming together. Almost there. Almost there. About to hit me with the mid fade. And then the blow dry. And we out, baby. Oh my God. Yeah. That's a big group of people right here. Dude, my hair is gone. It's obviously like a little mess here right now, but like. But basically, I got like a little crop. A little crop. Look at, look, that's the hair right there. Let's see. It's not all of it, because obviously I still got some length, but this is pretty much three years, bro. Oh my god, that's kind of nasty now. Ew. My hair clean. Money. No, I always keep my hair clean. Um, oh my god, bro. My head feels so good, though. Mm, let's pull up the complex color. What? Yo, it's good, guys. So my hair obviously looks a little more clean i'm super happy about it the homie brandon obviously killed it um i went for like a little crop um it's clean i just gotta put product in it so it doesn't look as like bowly it doesn't even really look like a bowl right now but when i put product it's obviously gonna look a lot cleaner he got down with the texture um but yeah super excited for complex con it is next week your boy is tired i just drove in like super traffic just to go get this cut and go sell those clothes but i hope you guys enjoyed it this was trip to thrift numero i don't know selling sessions number i don't know and random vlog footage for you guys but i hope you guys enjoyed it um you already know slogan so let's wrap it up to the coziest in the game amen to fashion what is Good.